They are often the kinds of kids that are called super predators. They're bringing drugs. They're bringing crime. They're rapists. They're trying to debate who's less racist. It's a trap. Welcome to Trap News. The news of the trap, where every four years the population is duped. I'm your host, Robert Solster. It's hitting the fan globally. U.S. citizens are once again asked to choose between coke and Pepsi. They got a right-wing kind of day, and the fascist businessmen, a doctor, another white guy. But we know who will win this election. We heard a lot of revolution talk, but revolution comes from the people, not a ballot box. Don't you remember? You voted for change, all you got was more wars. Now they're offering far less. You claim to deserve your vote. We face a climate catastrophe, mass economic terror Cops kill more blacks in 2015 than the height of the lynching era ISIS is on the march from their wars in the Middle East Let's check in with Donald Trump, see what he got to say White workers of the world, I am your voice I'm the only one on the planet who understands your plight Believe me, I'm the only one who can fix everything You want a blonde in every arm, a bomb for every Muslim I will stand up the scum, the women, the Mexicans Will we make America great? Great again, yes we clear Build that wall, kill them all We're gonna knock down a mosque and build them all I will walk the fine line between Mussolini and Berlusconi Everybody loves me, the KKK, even Nazis We don't need NATO, let them eat their baguettes We don't need them to stop the radical Islamic terrorists They won't even say the word, should we nuke them? She offers you Benghazi, I bring you solutions Well that's disconcerting, terrifying to say the least Let's go live to our other right wing candidate Listen to his words, he's lost his mind or something Unlike him, I'm promising absolutely nothing Heard enough Trump explaining, time to shatter the glass ceiling Do you want someone who can get shit done or a failed businessman? I get shit done, the Clinton Foundation Peddling access to the state for private corporations I'm J.P. Morgan, Chase approved to make power moves We'll let the Second Amendment people handle you You're not the law and order candidate Donald Don't you know me and my husband practically wrote the new Jim Crow I label black super predators, brought the three strikes rule Under the Clinton dynasty, prison populations, boom You're a racist and a fascist if you don't vote for me It's time to let a real woman lead Hillary, you must be talking about me Jill Stein, candidate of the Green Party I'm down with the shit, got the arrest record to prove it I'm the next dead end on the road to revolution If Donald Trump wins, it'll be all your fault The only reason you're the candidate is cause the system's rigged Don't even get me started on election fraud The DNC, Arizona, Brooklyn, shall I go on? Nobody likes you, you pull pot in a pantsuit You never do a motherfucking thing for working people All you promise is more Imperial wars and poverty All that may be true, but at least we got burning Remember me, suckers, I got your pump for revolution All we got the show for it, fucking lines on a platform Hillary sold the primary, but I can't complain I'm with the workers, I'm my third home, I'm like Champlain I never talk much about my foreign policy plan But if I was Lord of the Drones, the Middle East would feel the burn I channeled all your money and hopes into the system You wanted a revolution? Haha, <laughs> you got Clinton! <laughs> Democracy, what a steaming pile of shit Doesn't matter who wins the election, the Pentagon always gets in History explains you can't reform a broken oh, thank you. thing thank you. Don't believe me, let's oh. hear from Mr. Hope and Change I went from a new home! to attack of the drones. Why? A mannequin when it comes to ravaging sand peoples and blasting their homes. We're hashing the last chapter and the actions are known cause you'll spell war orphan with a capital O. We've the sequels, the farce awakens and it's hard to make the statement that I brought you hope and change when it's more like product placement. And for those undocumented patrons, I uh, thank you for your patience, but I'll deport you faster than iPhone 7 cases. I gave you DACA, well at least that's better than nada. I see you dreamers, but did you read the dreams of our fathers? U.S. doesn't want less, let's get more. Keep trade open like get mo Fake ass, I'm okay to get divorced, but I'm not just okay to get both. Thanks to the Muslim chief, white people are being hunted in the streets. I'm gonna build a wall, and Mexico's gonna pay for and if it. If Hillary's elected president, she'll cut off all our penises. Come again, mate? That makes no sense. It's the feminization of America. Tell him, Alex. Alex Jones here, the one who exposed the new world order. NAFTA was an NWO plot to destroy the border. Fluoride in the water, ruining young men's lives. Hillary gets in, we'll be breastfeeding and cooking for our wives. Donald Trump, he's the real deal, folks. He's the only one that can stand up to the fascism of 
the rap with their politically correct safe spaces. Or George Soros funds Black Lives Matter terrorists. Alex Jones, what happened to you? How did it come to this? How do you go from prison planet to promoting an actual fascist? This is the real spirit of 76. Make America great again for the white race. You criticize Nazi Germany, but Nazis support this dude. Well, Nazis like ice cream. Does Hillary want to take that too? Why do you reckon you get so much love from racists? You mean patriots? No, I mean 3%ers who want to bring back slavery. We need to get off Obama's plantation. It's either white genocide or we bring back the Constitution. I'm losing brain cells engaging this fool. Ayo, Stim. What up? You know what to do. America's never been great for people of color. Ooh, how vacuous it's all become. Hillary says America was always great. Trump says he'll make it great again. The media says there's only two sides to understand. Let's get a more nuanced response from a lost savage fan. This is all us coming from the illegally occupied indigenous territory, widely known as the United Snakes of America also known as the truest Ku Klux Klan replica, also known as the corrupted infestation of capitalist glorification. And it's ready to burn. So the land from coast to coast, so we'll disregard that both these politicians a joke or something more like a demon. They get plagued, they that virus, destroying the scheme, extreme incarnation of evil, blood suckers draining my people. That's why we riot in these cities, but they don't wanna hear me. This oppressive system could never uphold us. Deploy militarized police till they dare deem their trust. This system's illegitimate. We opted out, we opted out. Exposed for that hypocrisy, they show what they about. Promise salvation, the same breath that they sow seeds to doubt. Curses the devil's democracy, imposed on sacred ground. Freedom defined by tyrant's mind upholds this whole empire. If the flaw designed on self destruct, watch the White House catching fire. Say freedom defined by tyrant's mind upholds this whole empire. If the flaw designed on self destruct, watch the White House catching fire. Fire, fire, fire. And after all is said and done, what's really been accomplished? Will the winner of this contest do anything to stop global warming? How many hours did you spend watching? How much money in total was donated for your so-called revolution? If that's not a waste, then what isn't? What if that time was spent organizing in the area that you live in? Instead of Obamacare, which was a private insurance handout? What if you put your money into self-funded healthcare co-ops? Has anything worth robbing won through presidential campaigns? Civil rights, the abolition of slavery, the AI will work day can voting ever give us freedom what's a democracy in the era of mass corporate media statistically speaking wouldn't you have more influence passing up flyers downtown than to vote in an election did voting for kennedy stop the vietnam invasion do you really think the next president can put an end to racist policing that having a black president erase systematic racism isn't it a function of white supremacy that people of color in leadership positions and when they say they'll fix the economy what does that mean what's a job coming back in a massive pyramid scheme and how much does the economy really matter If by the end of the century Every major city gets underwater How can anyone say it's the pinnacle of civic duty When it accomplishes next to nothing time after time It's been proven Would we be talking about the cops We're not from Ferguson The better to beg for crumbs Or to take direct action If all you do is vote you can't complain It's clear if you really want to change everything Start anywhere 